In today's YouTube video, I'm gonna be talking to you about how to make money as an online fitness coach in 2023. And if you love this content, you're definitely gonna love the podcast. So make sure you subscribe to my dad's podcast, The Change Lives, Make Money Online Trainer Podcast. Oh, thanks, Fluff. Good boy. Okay, so I started online fitness coaching back in 2013. I was a bartender at an Irish pub and basically I didn't really know what I wanted to do with my life. So I was bartending and I was doing fitness competitions and I thought that I wanted to be a personal trainer. I ended up getting a personal trainer job in the gym. They were make, paying me like $20 an hour. I was selling $100 an hour and they were only paying me 20. So I'm like, this doesn't make any sense. So I decided to start coaching on the side online. Now, it was just on the side. I ended up taking a trip to uh, Bali slash Australia to visit my ex-girlfriend and uh, I wanted to go down there and be there with her for a couple weeks and then come back to Canada. Well, she ended up splitting up with me before I went on the trip. And when I went to Bali slash Australia, I was really sad about it. So I spent all my money drinking, partying, whatever. And by the time I got to, uh, by the time I got to Bali, um, I had $500 left in my bank and I had two weeks to spend in Bali. So I only have $500 and I have two weeks to spend in Bali. So I have two options. Option number one is call somebody for money, which I couldn't do because I didn't have any money and my family didn't come from money and like all of us didn't have a lot of money. So option number two was to figure it out and find a way to make online fitness coaching work. So I did. Um, that was the, that in that two to three week time span, I ended up making $5,000 which made me realize, I'm like, okay, if I can make five grand while in Bali, online coaching, when I come back to Canada, I can make way more. And that's when I started going all in. So um, essentially what I'm gonna teach you in today's YouTube episode is how to make money as an online fitness coach in 2023, even if you're a complete beginner. And I'm actually gonna show you my uh, my own personal stripe here. And as you can see, um, we made $164,000 in the week from December to January. So in the last seven days, we made 164 grand. We're taking in about $14,000 a day. And I show you these numbers not to brag, but I just wanna show you basically what's possible. All right, so, Here's the step-by-step process to take you from zero to three to $10,000 a month. And this is, it doesn't matter where you're currently starting. It doesn't matter if you're a complete beginner and you have zero clients or whether or not you like have a bunch of clients and you're an online trainer, you just wanna get to that next level. Maybe you're at 3K, you wanna scale to five to 10. No matter what level you're at, I'm gonna give you what you need in this YouTube episode to grow a successful online coaching business in 2023. Okay, so step number one is you need to set up your profile. So this is one of my clients, Desiree Clark. And as you can see from Desiree Clark's profile, it's set up in a way that it she looks professional. So her name's DC Fit Online uh, Transformation Coach. And she says, on a mission to help women build strong bodies and even stronger mindsets. Her profile picture looks presentable and professional. You can tell that it's done by a high quality camera. And most importantly, she's got an application in her bio. So always, you always wanna put an application in your bio. This is Jezre's application. She learned it inside of our coaching program. So you wanna have an opportunity for somebody to be able to reach out to you. Now, one of the biggest mistakes that I see online trainers make is when they're doing the application in their bio, a lot of online trainers will have either a link tree or a solo.to. That's not what you wanna do. The reason you don't wanna do that is it's gonna decrease the amount of people that will actually convert into an application. Because if you've got a bunch of options for them to choose from, they're gonna choose one of the options and you only want them to choose the option that gets them closer to working with you which is your client application. So when you set up your client, when you set up your profile, make sure that you set up your application in your bio, no link trees, no websites, none of that. So number one, again, one more time, number one is you need to set up your profile to attract your ideal client. Number two, create three different types of content, connection, proof, and value. Now I'm gonna show you a piece of connection content. So again, we're just gonna use Desiree's page as an example. A piece of connection content is just content that is about you. It's about who you are as an individual. It's about, it's about like you as a person. And so this video, as you can see from Desiree, this is her and her boyfriend, and it's just a little gym rat love story. And it just says POV, the we should work out together text uh, did its thing. So this is one per- piece of connection content. Another client I'm gonna show you actually, his name is Don Lamb, and he recently had a baby. And so Don Lamb, I'm gonna pull up his profile right here. A piece of connection content is just a picture, a video of Don Lamb's baby at one years old. And this type of content is so important for your social media because this type of content tells your audience that you're a real person. That's important. Uh, A lot of online fitness coaches, the reason they don't make any money online is because they're posting you know, workouts, they're posting meals, but they're not posting who they are. And so the first and most important piece of content that you can post is connection. And connection is helping your audience develop a better relationship with you. The second type of content that you should be posting is proof. Now, an example of proof I'm gonna show you right here is I'm actually gonna show you one of my, again, let's pull up Desiree's page. 
Proof is before and afters. So this is one of Desiree's clients and uh, just a before and after, boom, on the screen. And then it tells a story of that transformation. This is the single most important piece of content that you need to post if you want to attract online fitness coaching clients. This piece of content, if you only post one type of content, it would be proof. Uh, because this shows that you're an expert. Like when you've got before and afters of clients that you're working with, it's undeniable that you know what you're talking about. And so proof can come in many forms. Even if you're a completely beginner and you have no clients at all, what you can do for proof is you can take your beginner origin story in fitness and post about that, post the before and the after. And that origin story, that will show that you know what you're talking about. Proof is evidence that you're working with clients, evidence that your clients are getting better results, evidence that you know what you're talking about with fitness, that's proof. That's essentially what proof content is. The third type of content that you need to post is value. So again, I'm on Desiree's page, so I'm gonna pick on her. This is a valuable piece of content. So it says, 20 tips for the girls starting her fitness journey in 2022. And then if you press the over button, there's literally just 20 different tips that women that are starting their fitness journey can use. Now, this type of content is immensely valuable when it comes to delivering you know, a service to you, your audience that makes them wanna work with you because the people that are in Desiree's audience are gonna think to themselves, man, if Desiree's free content is this good, I wonder what her coaching program would look like. And that's the level that you want your free content to be at. You want your free content to be so good that people are like, man, if the free content is this valuable, I wonder what it would be like if I became one of their clients. And that's the effect that you wanna create. So again, the second thing that you need to do if you wanna make money as an online fitness coach in 2023 is post the three types of content, connection, proof, and value, okay? Step number three. The third thing that you need to do on your social media if you would like to make money as an online fitness coach in 2023 is create simple polls to get people to engage with you. So I'm actually gonna use myself as an example. So by the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, what are you doing? Click the button here. Um, so I'm gonna just pull up my profile because I posted uh, a story poll yesterday. And basically a story poll is a photo that you post and you're asking people to engage on that photo. So for me, what I posted is I posted just a picture of me, like a mirror selfie, and then I asked my audience, how are you feeling about 2023? Optimistic, I'm ready, decent, no complaints, or not good. Now what happens is when you post story polls like this and people engage with those story polls, those are your audience members interacting with your content, which means that they're gonna interact with other things that you do as well. Okay, so you wanna post story polls that will lead to conversations about fitness. As an example, you could post a photo like, you know, a photo of you in the gym flexing, and then the story poll could be like, do you feel like you have your fitness goals on point for 2023? Hell yes I do, no I need some work, or I don't care about my fitness goals. You have those three options. Anybody that votes on those options is somebody that you can have a conversation with about their fitness goals. And so the third thing that you wanna do is you wanna post story polls post one every day. It can be even when you're uh, eating your healthy meal, like do you prep your meals? Hell yes I do or no, comma, what's meal prep, question mark. And then when people vote on those polls, you can message them and be like, oh cool, like what do you do for your meal prep? Or the people that vote no, you're like, hey, like I noticed that you say you don't work on your meal prep, is that something that you'd be interested in doing? Like you can start conversations with people if you start putting out story polls that people can engage with your content. And this doesn't mean that you have to have like a big following. In fact, even if you have 100 people that watch your Instagram stories and five Five of them vote on your polls, if only three of them become your clients, you could make $3,000, right? So we really do have to think about the math and the situation and understanding that if you sell three clients for 12 week transformation packages at $1,000 a pop, like all you need is three, right? So to make money as an online fitness coach, it's a lot less complicated than a lot of people make it out to be, okay? Number four is to start the DM script to book qualified phone calls. Now, what do I mean by qualified phone calls? Basically, the DM script is a messenger process that me and my team have come up with to show you how to book phone calls with your potential clients. I'm actually just gonna pull up my DM script on my screen. So this is basically what you wanna do. You wanna post a story poll, somebody's gonna engage, and then you're gonna pull this up. And you're gonna be like, would you mind if I ask a couple questions to see if I can help? So once you start that conversation, be like, oh yeah, I saw that you struggle with your nutrition, how long have you been struggling with that? And they're gonna say something, you're like, cool, do you mind if I ask a couple questions to see if I can help? And then they're gonna say, sure. I'm like, okay, great. So what would you say has been the biggest struggle in your fitness journey in 2022? And they're gonna say something. And then no matter what they say, you're gonna move on to the next question. And then you're gonna send a screenshot of a client that you've worked with, so before and after, or a screenshot of yourself, be like I used to struggle with the same thing, so I've been there and I understand you. What's your number one fitness goal that you wanna have accomplished by 2023? And then they're gonna say, no matter what, and then you're gonna validate, relate, and lean in. 
you're gonna say, this is where we need to build a relationship and this is where a lot of people go wrong with the DM script, um, is we need to build a relationship with our potential clients. And so instead of just talking to them about their fitness goals, you wanna say something like, also I just went to your profile and I saw that you are a nurse, that's amazing, um, and I love that you wanna lose weight, that's a great goal. That sounds like you've got a good reason why and I can see that you're committed to this. What, like, what do you do for work and how, how active are you? Now the reason you wanna ask them what they do for work and how active, how active they are is because this will give you an idea of whether or not they're financially qualified to get on a phone call. If they say that like they're, not, they're unemployed and they're not very active, obviously this person probably wouldn't have the money for a fitness program, so we might wanna offer them something low ticket in the DMs. But if they're like, I'm a nurse and I work 16 hours a day, I'm like, okay, great, cool, and then we move on to the next question. And in the next 30 days, what would you say the top three things that you need to do if you wanna lose 20 pounds like you said you wanna lose? And then they're gonna say thing one, thing two, thing three, and you're gonna be like, cool, would you like some help? Once they say yes, you're gonna book a call. And that literally is a DM script, all right? So you want to set up a profile, you wanna post content, you wanna post story polls, then when people engage with those story polls, you wanna use the DM script to book phone calls, okay? So now we're on to step five, because once you're on the call, amazing, but they're gonna show up to the call. And when they show up to the call, what do you do? What did I just say? Step number five is you need to use free fitness assessments to sell high ticket packages. That's step number five. Now when I say free fitness assessments, what I mean is you wanna book a call with your potential clients and you want to uncover their pain, like what they're struggling with. You wanna uncover their vision, like their goals and what they wanna accomplish. And then on that 15 to 20 minute sales call, you want to paint a picture of how your coaching program is gonna help them get from their pain to their vision. That's the goal. Right? And at the end of the call, once you clearly can articulate what their problem is, and you clearly can articulate what their goals are, you're gonna present your product as the solution to get them from their problem to their goals. We're not selling your high ticket coaching package. We're selling a high ticket solution to their problem. There's a big difference. And so what you need to do on the call is you need to get them clear on where, they, where they're at right now and where they wanna go. And the truth is a lot of people don't know this stuff. Like they don't know where they're at right now. They're not even aware that they've been struggling with the last three years because most people just dilute themselves into believing that everything's okay until you can start to ask them the questions that will make them aware. Like, oh, I actually don't like feeling like this and I have serious goals because I wanna be able to play with my kids and I don't have the energy to play with my kids right now because I'm overweight and I eat fast food every day. But that's the type of stuff that you can uncover on that call. And when you create a gap between where they are and where they wanna be, they're gonna wanna purchase your product to help them solve that problem. Does that make sense? Drop makes sense in the comments if you guys are with me so far. Okay, so set up your profile online, create three different types of content, create simple polls to get people to engage with you, start the DM script to book qualified phone calls, get them on the phone and do a free 15 minute call to uncover their pain points and their goals. Step number six, is you're going to enroll them in thousand dollar high ticket online coaching packages. All right, so what I usually recommend for my online coaches is a thousand dollars for a 16 week program or $250 per month. All right, so that's the prices that we offer. So what you wanna do is on the call, once you've figured out you know, what their pain is, you're gonna offer them a solution and the solution is gonna be your online coaching program and it's gonna be a thousand dollars for 16 weeks or $250 per month and that's it. All right, you enroll them into your program. Once they pay you the money, you send them the questionnaire, which gives you a little bit more info on like their like specific numbers so that when you're making their meal plan and training plan, you can make it based on these recommendations that you're getting from their questionnaire. Cool. Number seven is once they're actually enrolled in the program, you need to over deliver and you need to actually change their life. So I'm going to give you two different apps that you can use that are going to supercharge the amount of value that you can give with your online coaching program. So app number one, we're gonna pull it up on the screen. App number one is Trainerize. I'm a big, big, big believer in Trainerize. Um, I've been using Trainerize since 2013 when I became an online fitness coach. Uh, this was the app that I used when I made my $5,000 when I was in Bali. And this was the app that I've recommended literally over 2,500 online coaches to. Highly recommend Trainerize. There's actually a link in the description of this video that you guys can use. <clears throat> so Trainerize would be the first app. The second one that I would use would be Evolution Nutrition. Now Evolution Nutrition is incredible because for a low monthly fee, it's like $49 a month. If you have you know, five clients paying you $300 a month, right? That's $1,500. Then Evolution Nutrition and Trainerize is $49 a month, $49 a month. You can manage 15 clients, five to 15 clients to 50 clients with this like low 
like run rate and the only cost that you will ever have to pay as an online fitness coach will be trainerized like evolution nutrition and like your calendar that's really the goal and so evolution nutrition is really cool because it's a meal planning software for pros at 49 dollars a month you can literally log in type your client stats that you get from the questionnaire and it will spit you out a meal plan just like that so highly 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 recommend in summary, I've worked with over 2,500 online fitness coaches and I've got 250 plus of them that are over $10,000 a month. And uh, this information that you see in this video is not guesswork, all right? If you got value from this video and you wanna learn more about how I can help you grow a successful online coaching business, I want you to DM me freedom on Instagram. That's where I take all the incoming inquiries and that's where you can find out a little bit more information about some of the stuff that we've talked about today. And uh, hopefully I can provide you with more value and help you grow a successful online coaching business. Um, not only just for free, but also like, you know, take you to $10,000 a month like I've already done with 250 online coaches. Um, if you got got value from this video, I would appreciate it if you could like, leave a comment, and make sure you're subscribed. Um, and if this value, this video was valuable to you, if you know a friend that is an online fitness coach, do me a favor, share this video with them because I think that this video could really help a lot of people start successful online coaching businesses. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you have the best day of your entire life and chase your dreams. Let's go.